now that you say that, for example, you being able to have one in Club 11, I'm pretty sure it's because yeah. you know someone, right? Yeah, yeah. Because it's so hard to get them in those locations, yeah, exactly. right? And how does that work? Obviously, the owner of Club 11 also gets, gets yeah. a cut of that, right? Yeah. I guess, I so, I mean, basically, um, I had to pay, yeah, you know? Yeah, yeah, like everyone asked for obviously. a five-year contract, obviously. and that's how I was able to close the location. Mm -hmm. You know, you, as soon as you get into the business, you have to start talking to people, make connections. Yeah. That's how I was able to get that location. So, it's very important. He, he said, let me, I'll, I'll start with you now, but <laughs> you just said it's very important to, to talk with people, make yeah. connections or communicate, yeah, you know, be open, be open, be exactly. not, not have like, uh, not be shy. Exactly. So he's just said a very important thing that I always say, mm -hmm. in order to be successful, you got to get out there, communicate, exactly. right? You yeah. can't just be in your shell, like in your room. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you know, you got to open yourself, right? You got to go to events, networking, exactly. you know, yeah. and you got to reach out to people you never, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. If, if you're shy, I feel like you're holding yourself yeah, back. Yeah, yeah. You know? So what about yourself, man? So I moved to Vegas two years ago. I lived in Miami. I made my whole family move out here because I wanted an opportunity. I told them that Miami, I couldn't see anything. So we moved over here. And like you said, I started networking. I, um, I was doing photography for cars. Oh shit. And I got to meet this person. Um, he actually almost shot down the road and I was doing custom motorcycles with him. Custom motorcycles? Yeah, okay, custom sure. Harley V-Rods. Okay, oh, he, oh shit, that yeah. is dope. That is dope, man. So we would black them out, complete, I'll show you some pictures. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sick bikes. And then I met Mo because I asked him to do a photo shoot of his GTR. Oh yeah, so, so you met him because you did a photo to his GTR, yeah. right? Yeah. Okay, cool, that's cool. Yeah. And he offered to do a free photo shoot. I was yeah. like, why not? Yeah, yeah, why not? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So you see, very, very important thing, lesson you can learn here. Be, be, how you say in English? Open minded. Be open minded and be, uh, for example, you gotta be uh, willing to work for free. Sometimes, because I always say, yeah. where, where you find opportunities is when, when you do stuff for free, when mm -hmm. you do stuff because you like it, right? I always yeah. say, like, you don't network asking people, hey, can I get this? Can I get yeah, that? And yeah. it's not like, what can I give him? So he's like, oh, what, what, what can I give him? I can give him a free photo shoot. Hey, yeah. that's how he met him. That's how you guys are business yeah. partners now. Yeah. That's crazy, yeah, right? We have 25 cars here. Exactly, yeah. you know, so you, you, people, the thing, like, people get so trapped in, like, no, they got to pay me to do something. Yeah. yeah, that's the problem. Like, if you want to be an entrepreneur, mm -hmm. you gotta start first. Now I'm gonna do this shit without getting paid. Yeah. So then after, after maybe years, I'm gonna get in, getting paid big to like drive one of those. <laughs> you know, <laughs> but like you, you can't be willing to always like you know what's how much how much yeah. you gonna pay me how much you gonna pay me yeah, exactly honestly, look you right now your business started because you did something for free yeah. Did you do? Did you did you put some time for free, or like I guess you put time without getting paid to discover how do you do this ATM yeah, machine? Yeah, exactly. Right? Yeah, I, I mean I paid someone to. You learn. paid, so I bought a course. You, yeah. you know that you didn't pay. You paid someone, yeah. so you know like <laughs> yeah. you gotta be willing to pay for for knowledge. So look, exactly. That's another big important thing. So you believe that uh, knowledge, buying knowledge, yeah. is one of the most important. Definitely, things. I think investing in yourself, buying like courses. Yeah books and watching content is really good for you because like yes you could go to college and learn things yeah. but there's a lot of people in this Starbucks working right now have a bachelor degree yeah, yeah, you know yeah. and they spend 60 80 hundred thousand dollars on their degree yeah. but they're still working at Starbucks you exactly. know but I spent one thousand mm dollar -hmm. on a course that taught me how to learn the ATM business from A through Z and I made over you know half a million dollars just from that course you know it's crazy because and I mean, we haven't spoken before you and me. Yeah. We've only met with the cars. We yeah. never spoke about business or anything. Yeah. And I, I, they always ask me, oh, what do I invest my money in? And I always say, dude, the first thing is yourself, like yeah. yourself. And he's saying the same thing. Like, and like the, the thing is like, people are willing to pay for like uh, university mm -hmm. school, yeah. to, like hundreds of thousands of dollars yeah. to learn what do like, like your teacher is like an employee. Like what's well, gonna teach you yeah. about like making money or like investments. Like the best investment you can do is in knowledge and as he said, when you invest in like in a targeted like course, your mm -hmm. course was teaching you how to open ADM machines and like mm -hmm. just literally focused on that, yeah. became an expert and that's what exactly. that's what brought you here probably. Like, yeah. Without that, <laughs> that was the you could start. Not, yeah. That was a startup. Yeah. Sweet, you wanna you wanna roll to your place yeah. or Let's do it. keep going yeah. there? Let's do it, man. Sure.
let me be I got a lot to say I hope you don't feel no way I hope you don't make the same Mistakes when you blow the flame You're kind of obsessive to me You're kind of too strong on your feet I can't say that I guarantee Ooh. Bueno, Magnus, aquí estamos You guys have inside a Vegas Auto Gallery Yeah Shit Okay We go car shopping all the time <laughs> Have you bought any cars from there? Yeah, no, yeah I haven't bought, I was this yeah. close yeah. I, I told them one time I was this close of buying an Aventador for them. I should have mm. bought it, but at that time it was just before buying my first house. Oh, okay. So I was like, I know how that is. I didn't, I didn't want to like, you know, buy it and then yeah. the the mortgage not going through just because like, hey, what's what's with this like, yeah. you know? <laughs> so I was like, I'll buy first the house. <laughs> my wife's gonna kill me. Yeah. yeah. And then Mo gifted me a. Uh... Damn, which one did you give me? That's uh. not... Pre uh, president. Presidential. Presidential, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a blue face. Yeah, it's nice. oh, the blue yeah. face. Yeah, that was yeah. the first one I ever got was his. Oh, yeah. I, um, I get all my watches from Dubai. Oh, yeah, from yeah. Dubai? Yeah. You have like contact yeah. in Rolex or something like yeah. that? Not Rolex, but a third party seller. Okay. But they're a little bit over MSRP. Yeah, and, yeah, yeah, yeah. and I get, when I bring it back, I get money for the taxes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so I don't pay any taxes, I so I get the money. Dude, yeah. I, got, I got this one in Rolex here, mm -hmm. MSRP. Oh, wow. Damn, uh, I didn't crazy. even believe it myself. Yeah. <laughs> Just gotta walk in like several dealers. Yeah. Just introduce yourself. Like yeah. they know they like locals. They, yeah, they like. They, they want to sell the watches to locals. So yeah. sometimes it's I don't know. You're yeah. lucky, or you like. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. you buy with that person, and they're like, I'll give it to you. Yeah, you exactly. Know? Yeah. So it's, they had it in stock too. No, I mean they it took you, a few right? weeks, but this is the buy man do. Yeah. Like this is so hard yeah. to get it. MSRP yeah, from rare. Rolex. Yeah. yeah, like instantly it's like two, three times yeah, more. Yeah, Batman pay. and the Hulk too. Yeah, the Hulk, Hulk I have. Oh, that'll look good. Yeah, I have the Hulk. I want to get. Oh, you have it? Yeah, dude, don't sell that. I know, no, no. It's gonna. I, the price. Dude, that's the first Rolex I bought. That's yeah. my favorite one, the Hog. Yeah. I love it, dude. It's yeah. so sick. It's just like all green. Yeah. Everything inside, yeah. outside. Yeah.